is very very important to uh, reminding yourself how important it is to change your life when phoenix malls and sue charity foundation collaborated the idea was you know we have so many needy people around us they are always waiting for that one hand to hold that you know okay a life can change so i think that's a mission that you know whenever you buy something in bringing someone's smile back Welcome to Entrepreneur Media, everyone. I'm joined with a very well-recognized name, Sonu Sood. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm so honored to be in conversation with you, sir. Thank you so much, Let Kavir. me start with, can you, what can you tell us about this collaboration? We are in Phoenix Mall right now. Yeah. What is this all about, sir? You know, I think um, it's very, very important to um, always keep, um, uh, you know, reminding yourself how important it is to change your life. You know, when we get busy with our lives, you know, making our businesses uh, big, buying a new car, by making a new house, going for a shopping. So we forget about everything that's happening around, the people who are suffering, the people who are going through the difficult times. So I think it was very, very important to uh, keep that uh, check that, you know, whenever you buy something, uh, a part of that goes uh, in bringing someone's smile back. So when um, you know, Phoenix Malls and Sue Charity Foundation collaborated, the idea was, you know, we have so many needy play people around us and, you know, sometimes uh, they're always waiting for that one uh, hand to hold that, you know, okay, a life can change. So I think that's a mission uh, that uh, we are here for and we'll make sure that every uh, person who buys anything from the mall, uh, a part of that goes uh, in changing a life. That's such a great initiative and such a lovely thought. So I want to understand, uh, in your experience as an entrepreneur, as a person who is so heavily involved in business beyond being an artist, yes. first, how are you balancing both of these two things? Do you feel they contradict the spaces or they go hand in hand? Um, I was a businessman first. My dad um, you know, had a cloth showroom in Punjab and somewhere the, the business thing runs in my DNA. Uh, then, okay, I became an artist. but. Uh, every time, um, you know, I met my friends, they said, you know, you're a businessman, you're going to produce films, you're going to direct films, you're going to do a lot of things. And I'm doing that also. But apart from that, you know, um, um, I, I feel uh, if you're a good learner, you can grow fast in life. Um, you know, every time I come across, you know, when we started apps like, uh, you know, my social media app, which is Explosure, when we talk, started about something called Intercell giving back in the education or Ilaj India or Spice Money, all these people, uh, all, all these apps have started with a mission to change a life, um, you know, to create jobs uh, and um, bring awareness about, you know, what's happening around. And all these apps are among the top, you know, apps around the country we have. And I, 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 I always feel that, you know, um, um, I'm, I'm a good learner whenever I come across someone who's uh, been an expert in something. So I always uh, uh, listen to what's happening and I try to incorporate it in my system also. I think that keeps me growing. So there is a variety of businesses that you've put yourself yeah. in. It's a huge variety. How do you pick this? I, I think my instinct. Um, uh, I always tell, my, my, my father used to say, tell me when I used to sit with him on the shop. He said, you're not a good businessman if someone comes to buy a dupatta from your shop and you sell him a dupatta, you're not a good businessman. You're a good businessman if he comes, someone comes to buy a dupatta, you sell a suit also with that. So I think that's what I've learned from him and uh, that keeps me uh, always aware and alerted that you know how I can um, you know do something big. That's awesome. Last question. Could we have three recommendations, either a book or films that made an impact for you that you'd recommend to the audience that loves you so much? I think there's one um, uh, book that my mom gave me. Uh, it, it was a book on quotes, you know, how uh, those quotes can change lives. Uh, she, um, you know, made all those important quotes, you know, she put all those markers on that, that, you know, you should read to inspire yourself. And I still do that. My mom is not around, but with those uh, quotes, you know, I feel that she's the one who's guiding me. So that book made a lot of impact on me. Um, then, so, then the films, if you talk about, you know, I think every film teaches us something. You know, now I'm a filmmaker, I'm directing films. So I think bad films teaches us not to make bad films. And good films inspire us to make some uh, good cinema. And now I've just uh, completed my film, which I wrote, directed, produced, and acted um, for the. So the idea was to make a film which um, will um, bring a huge change in, uh, I would say, the Bollywood cinema. And um, past two and a half years, I've been working on that. So yes, I, I see Fateh is um, one of my most special babies. Okay, so thank you so much. Thank for you your so time. much, Kavya. God so bless much. you. Keep shining. Thank you. Thank you.